welcome to the new video on analysis of variance. ANOVA is a conceptually simple, powerful, and popular way to perform statistical testing on experiments that involve two or more groups. It is used to test for difference among three or more population means. It allows for multiple comparisons while holding the probability of a type 1 error, that is rejection of a true null hypothesis, at a pre-selected level. ANOVA works by comparing variance estimates, one due to chance factor alone and one due to chance plus treatment effect. Additionally, ANOVA test is a way to find out if survey or experiment results are significant. In other words, they help you to figure out if you need to reject the null hypothesis or accept the alternative hypothesis. Basically, you are resulting groups to see if there is a difference between them. Here we can take two examples when you might want to test different groups. For example, a manufacturer has two different processes to make light bulbs. He wants to know if one process is better than the other. Another example we can take students from different colleges take the same exam. You want to see if one college outperforms the others. But what does one way or two way mean? One way or two way refers to the number of independent variables IVs in your analysis of variance test. One way test has independent variable with two levels, for example, brand of cereal. Two way has two independent variables. It can have multiple levels, for example, brand of cereals and calories. Then what are the groups or levels? Actually. Groups or levels are different groups within the same independent variable. In the earlier example, your levels of brand of cereals might be Lucky Charms, Raisin Bran, and Corn Flax. A total of three levels. Your level for calories might be sweetened, unsweetened, a total of two levels. Types of tests. There are two main types in ANOVA, one way and two way. Two-way test can be with or without replication. Initially, one-way ANOVA between groups. It used when you want to test two groups to see if there is a difference between them. However, two-way ANOVA without replication is used when you have one group and you are double testing that same group. For example, you are testing one set of individuals before and after they take a medication to see if it works or not. And finally, two-way ANOVA with replication. In two groups and the numbers of those, groups are doing more than one thing. For example, two groups of patients from different hospitals trying two different therapies. It was a short introduction of ANOVA. So there are relevant terms for ANOVA, for example, experiment, study or investigation designed for the purpose of examining the effect that one variable has on the values of other variable. Dependent variable, the variable for which a value is measured or observed. Specifically in ANOVA, the dependent variable will be a quantitative variable. For example, soft drink consumption, examination score or the time required to type a document. An independent variable, a variable that is observed or controlled for the purpose of determining its effect on the value of the dependent variable. In ANOVA, the independent variable can be a qualitative, that is material status or quantitative, that's age group. A factor. A factor refers to a categorical quantity under examination in an experiment as a possible cause of variation in the response variable. And finally, levels. It refers to the categories, measurements, or strata of a factor of interest in the experiment. Hopefully, you learn about ANOVA. In the next video, you will be able to see how we can compute and how we see the results. Please subscribe the channel and click at bell icon.